India's Advanced Medium Combat Aircraft AMCA program has advanced with the submission of bids from seven major Indian firms and consortiums aiming to partner with the Defence Research and Development Organisation DRDO for developing the country's first indigenous fifth generation stealth fighter. Seven Indian firms including LNT, HAL, Adani Defence, Tata Advanced Systems and Kalyani Strategic Systems have submitted bids for the Advanced Multi-Role Combat Aircraft Program, India's largest military R&D project. This mix reflects a deliberate push by the Ministry of Defence to involve private sector players alongside state-owned enterprises, fostering competition and diversifying production capabilities beyond traditional public sector dominance. The Aeronautical Development Agency, a DRDO entity overseeing the AMCA project, seeks a twin-engine, single-seat, all-weather multi-role fighter with advanced stealth features, including low radar cross-section through specialized shaping and materials, super cruise capability for sustained supersonic flight without afterburners and integrated sensor fusion for enhanced situational awareness. The aircraft must incorporate artificial intelligence for decision support, compatibility with unmanned teaming operations and a modular design to facilitate future upgrades. ADA's requirements emphasize indigenous content exceeding 70% in critical systems like avionics, radar and weapons integration, aligning with India's self-reliance goals in defense manufacturing. The project demands the selected partners to handle full-scale engineering development, prototype fabrication and eventual series production with an initial focus on five prototypes for testing. The allocated budget for the AMCA's design and development phase stands at Rs 15,000 crore, approved by the Cabinet Committee on Security in March 2024, covering airframe construction, avionics integration and flight testing infrastructure. This funding excludes subsequent production costs, which could escalate significantly for the planned 200-plus aircraft fleet. Timelines are aggressive, with the design largely frozen as of mid-2025, targeting prototype rollout by late 2026 or early 2027, first flight between 2027 and 2029, and initial operational clearance by 2032, leading to full induction into the Indian Air Force by 2034-2035. ADA plans intensive flight testing, aiming for over a thousand sorties per prototype to compress certification, drawing lessons from delays in prior programs like the Tejas. Engine selection remains a pivotal aspect, with the initial prototypes powered by modified General Electric F414 engines co-developed with an Indian partner to deliver up to 110 kN thrust for interim operations. Long term, ADA requires a fully indigenous or jointly developed 110 to 125 kN class engine with thrust vectoring for superior maneuverability, low observability and high temperature tolerance. India has selected France's Saffron for co-development, leveraging technology from the Rafale's M88 engine, though discussions with Rolls-Royce persist as a potential alternative. This engine must enable supercruise at Mach 1.5 and integrate seamlessly with the airframe for optimal stealth and performance. Among the bidders, HAL brings proven aerospace manufacturing experience from the Tejas program, including airframe assembly and systems integration, though it has faced criticism for production delays. LNT, with its expertise in precision engineering and composite structures from submarine and missile projects, complements BEL strengths in radar, electronic warfare systems, and avionics, positioning their consortium as capable in high tech subsystems. The BEML Bharat Forge Data Patterns Group leverages Bharat Forge's advanced forging and metallurgy for critical components like landing gear and engine parts, BEML's heavy engineering for structural elements and data patterns electronic systems for sensors and displays, offering a balanced approach to materials and electronics. TASL stands out with its global partnerships, having assembled helicopters and aircraft fuselages for Boeing and Airbus, providing skills in large-scale assembly and supply chain management. Adani Defence, though newer to aviation, contributes through its drone manufacturing and joint ventures in munitions and small arms, potentially adding agility in rapid prototyping and cost-effective production scaling. Kalyani Strategic Systems, tied to Bharat Forge, emphasizes high-strength materials and precision manufacturing, essential for stealth coatings and durable airframes. A committee led by former DRDO scientist A. Sivathanu Pillai will evaluate these bids on technical merits, cost proposals and delivery timelines over the next three to six months, potentially awarding contracts by early 2026 to ensure the program stays on track. This competitive process could distribute work across multiple players, mitigating risks and building a broader industrial base for future defence needs.